Hi everyone, and welcome back to George's Kitchen. I am so proud to be here. Um, it is now to actually open with season two, episode one. So today we're gonna learn about vegetarian meals, which I never had a vegetarian meal before. So, um, all right. So today we're gonna make shrimp pasta with garlic. Um, I'm gonna show you the banners, and then I'm gonna show you the food, and then we can get to cooking. All right. So. There you go. Welcome everyone to the opening of season two, episode one, here on George's Kitchen. I am your host, Chef G. Please watch all the episodes on my page on Facebook Live. Please comment and share my videos to your friends and families. Please watch the watch party. Let's get cooking. And lastly, and viewers like you. Thank you. All right, so now I'm gonna show you um, what we're gonna make. And then maybe one tour, uh, a side tour of our freshly goaded. So today we're making uh, shrimp pasta with garlic. These are the things that you need. You need a knife, cutting board, basil, salt and pepper, butter, you need oil, garlic, some pasta, and for the main event, this is boiled on zucchini with red shrimp, baby. And then over here we have is pots and pans. We've got a spatula to stir it up. You need tongs. Um, you also need um, one pot for the pasta and one skillet to make the shrimp, okay? And here we go. Let's do step number one. Heat oil in a pan and saute the garlic. Oh, I have to do it And you need your measuring cups. Right. So, okay, so let me move this stuff out of the way. So I'm just going to get the oil ready. And let's say, um, let's put it one fourth of oil. There we go. That 
that the oil right there there we go now we need to cut off the garlic it's a lot easier to take off the paper from the garlic Also, it is a beautiful day on a Saturday. I'm so excited that I get to be outside, maybe later on today. But the best part was actually doing this, because I really miss cooking a lot. I had a huge break, and I deserved it. And not only that, I do have some news to tell you guys. I graduated from college just recently. So cooking is a really great idea of getting your hands busy. And you're in a room where there are like no people. You have to cook either by yourself or with a partner. But today it is just me. Maybe in about a week or so, I might need another gas stove for the next meal. Okay, now we're gonna cut up the garlic. Okay. Oh, you guys are not seeing this. There we go, that's my photo. Awesome, all right. The whole object of using a knife is not to cut yourself. Trust me, I've had bad experiences with that. Now, we're just gonna Make it even smaller. Just like this. You always have to have your hand on top of the knife so that way you don't have to, you know, cut your hand off. Okay? Just like that. All right, so now we can come over here. Awesome, good. So now, we're going to put the oil into the saute pan right here. Just like that. You have to make sure that the whole oil covers the pan, okay? Just like that. Okay. All right, now let's get the garlic. Into the pan. Okay. I do need my spatula. And then we'll just have to push it like this. This is going so good. There will be the question of, there will be a question of the day after I'm done cooking. We need to make sure that the garlic 
is completely brown until we do the next step. In a little bit, we also have to make the pasta too. Okay, we're just gonna we're just gonna do a shrimp pot first. <sighs> it's very um, it's very nice, and um, the whole point of getting the garlic nice and brown. It won't be that much uh, crispier than you think, um, but it's going to be really tasty with the shrimp and the pasta. And this is for tonight's dinner and today's show. I'm only using YouTube. I'm no longer doing Facebook. Well, I will be doing Facebook, so it's a little bit of both. Okay, I'm gonna let that go for a while. Okay, now we're gonna do the, um, the next step. <sighs> All right, the next thing we're gonna add is the shrimp. That's what the shrimp is going to look like, okay? Now I'm going to, oh, oh. I'm going to open the shrimp, okay? I'm going to back here. I'm not going to use the whole shrimp. So basically, you're frozen. So we have to wait until everything is completely pink. Not dark pink, medium pink. Okay? We're not going to do step three quite yet. I have to get ready for the pasta because that's step five. Okay, so the... Uh, oh, wait. This is the pasta that we're going to use, okay? We have to bring the water to the boil and add pasta and salt to taste. Okay. Alright, 
Then we're going to turn this on. And I can add salt to it so that way it will boil. Just like that. So this has to be colored too as well. So we can do step by step. Okay, so we're going to have two things going on. Okay, 